in the past, cities were designed in a way where buildings and facilities were constructed first, and then parks were crammed into whatever was left. But Xiong An is uprooting this methodology and planting green before building the city. So Mr. Zhu was just showing me that this is a healthy tree. You can see from the root here that it's completely light flesh compared to the unhealthy tree where there's a little bit of red. It's more pronounced when you peel back the bark and it actually looks a bit like blood. Okay, time to stop monkeying around. Let's go find out what's actually behind the Shaolin project. As part of the Millennial Shaolin project, 11 million trees have already been planted, covering 110,000 mu. This year, that number will be tripled. We can breathe easy knowing that these forests will help reduce air pollution by absorbing almost 320 tons of atmospheric pollutants. That's equal to the annual emissions of 90,000 cars. It used to be cool to be a tree hugger, but now it's the age of the tree scanners. See, each one of these delicate saplings has its own unique QR code, so you can follow its growth and development from twig to branch. Here's my story of love at first scan. This is Fern. He doesn't talk much, but he can support me, and that's all I'm looking for right now. It's all good guys, we've traced our roots and we don't have the same family tree. It's too early to say, but we hope that this budding relationship will blossom into something more. <sighs> but the QR codes serve a higher purpose because in Xiong'an, the tech ecosystem and the green ecosystem unite. All of the analytical information relating to each tree will be fed into the Xiong'an Forest Big Data System app which will help monitor the status of the forest and plan future development. In Xiong'an, we can see that the seeds have been sown for the future. Hopefully, the roots that we have examined here will take hold and sprout into a green, prosperous and developed city.